Hold up. Welcome back guys to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can do validation for your cell phone number using JavaScript. So let's get started. First thing what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to copy paste the HTML part because I'm not going to type this HTML part. I'm just going to copy this whole thing. Copy this. I'm going to paste it here. Okay. It's done. Okay. I'm going to cancel this and let's start with coding in JavaScript. this I'm going to type regular expression so I'm going to explain you this regular expression so basically I'm from India and in India the cell phone number are of 10 digit which starts from 7 to 9 so it starts from 7 to 9 and after that it start from anything between 0 to 9 of, of 10 digit and numeric and that's it now after this we are going to add one button click on button submit click So guys if you haven't watched previous video you should watch previous video because I have already come con uh, I have already covered this concept str message so it will be easy to you understand now even if you haven't watched previous video I am going to explain the same on this video. Legit. 
attic and this much and after this I'm going to light another if condition if str message dot length equal to sorry not equal to 16 so guys why I am writing this str message length because the length in here is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 so length of str message is 16 and if this condition gets true it will one more length get added so it will become 17 so if this condition become false so it won't apply any validation and if this condition becomes true it will apply a validation so i'm going to write this code so it will be easy to understand you by seeing the code Missing response body dot html str message Missing responses dot model backdrop static. Keyboard false after this. Missing responses dot model. And after this, if condition, it will be another else condition to show whether your validation is successful or not. So what I'm going to do in this is I'm going to copy this much. I'm going to paste it here. And after this, just so that's it. And copy this much also. Just this to here. that's it I guess sorry okay so that's it I guess I'm going to save this as save form validation part 2 I'm going to save this now I'm going to run this in Chrome Okay, so we got successfully run, but let's check. Okay, so button click it is not showing anything. Let's check what is the problem. I think there is something we have forgotten to add or something coding mistake happened. 
so let's check on the console what is the issue okay okay on document that ready to be from mountain to right okay so this kind of silly mistake always happens with any programmer and one more thing But we should not write this in our double quotes or anything like that. And okay, one more thing here. Validation successfully clear. And now I'm going to save this and let's refresh this page and let's check if it is working fine or not. So this got wrong. Okay, so it is showing mobile number must be 10 digit valid and numeric. Let's type number like this. Okay, so it is showing now I'm going to add number with 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and 0. So it is a 10 digit number and it is a valid number so let's check so it is showing validation successfully clear so you can see this so guys you can also do this kind of validation for your cell phone number even if you are living in another country you can write your validation according to this so you saw this video so I think that is it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you really did please subscribe to my channel and I will be back with another video like this. Thank you.